Hi, I'm Tamsin Merchant and my first book, The Hatmakers, is going to be published next year by Norton Young Readers. My book actually started out as a dream that I had when I was filming a TV show in Prague called Carnival Row. There were so many amazing hats being made in the costume department. Um, and as a result of hearing about all of these incredible hats and these very special hat makers making the hats, I had a dream one night. This is the hat that actually started the dream. But I woke up from this really vivid dream and I thought, I've got to write that down. This is the result of me writing down my dream. Seven drafts later and I created this magical world um, set in the 1700s in London and there are magical families with big rivalries that go back decades. There are chases through misty London, there are flamboyant actors strutting around the stage of the Theatre Royal Drury Lane, there are kidnappings and thievery, there's intrigue, there are shipwrecks and fights on the decks of galleons and escapes from the Tower of London. And I don't want to say too much, otherwise I'll give everything away. But at the heart of the story is Cordelia Hatmaker, an 11 year old hero who starts out by going on a quest to find her missing father and ends up realising that if she doesn't get the most magical hat she can make on the right royal head in time, then all will be lost. <laughs> but what makes a hat magical? It's the ingredients you weave into the hat. For example, a bloom from a trumpet lily, which will give self-confidence in public speaking. A risible mushroom. Used on a hat, a risible mushroom will help a bashful person surprise himself with their own sense of spirit and playfulness. A feather from an upstart crow will give poise and self-confidence, but not all ingredients are good. Lightning strife, for example, the whisker from a sabre tiger, an orcus fox claw. But the less said about those, the better. So, I hope you'll join me and Cordelia Hatmaker in a hair-raising, hat-raising adventure. <laughs> and like Captain Prospero Hatmaker always says, keep wildness in your wits and magic in your fingertips.